Hello, good morning or good evening. In the last session, we have seen about uh, operating system. Now, in this video, we'll see the types of operating system. There are two types of operating system. One is a single user operating system, and another is a multi user operating system. So, what is a single user operating system? Single user operating system means it can OS can take care of user and computer interface which it act as an interface for only one user there is this then it is called as a single user operating system that means uh, if if you if you, in your system if a single user is working on a particular system then it is called as a single user operating system and uh, that system is not accessed by any other operating system example ms dos we will learn about ms dos in later videos and uh, <coughs> These are like all standalone computers command under these categories. Means the processors of computer does only one job at a time. Okay, the single user working onto a single machine and multi-user operating system. Multi-user operating system computer acts as an interface for one or more than one user. In this process, at a given point of time, it can still process only one user work. But there are many instances in between the operating system when the operating system is ideal. Idle. So in such a time, it goes to the other user. In this way, it can work for more than one user. User may not experience this because it happens very fast. See, there is a one system that has been connected to, it is being connected by multiple users and they are performing multiple tasks at a time. So this is about uh, types of operating system that is a multi-user operating system and a single user operating system. So thank you everyone for watching this video. Have a great and pleasurable day or an, an evening.